Next, we have the Chladni plate module, uh, which is built around a resonance speaker. And this resonance speaker is a perfect alternative to the subwoofer I had been using because it is much quieter. Uh, unlike a subwoofer, which has a cone that's meant to push a lot of air, meant to make a lot of sound, this resonance speaker is just meant to vibrate against something else that's resonant, making that make the sound. Uh, so by attaching the metal plate directly to the resonance speaker, we should only have the, the metal plate vibrating instead of the speaker cone as well. Additionally, there is an LED on the inside that is lit when the tone generator is plugged in. The Chladni plate experiment. So first, we'll need a tone from our tone generator, which will then be sent to the Chladni plate module. Plugging it in. When we turn it on, it should light up, and you should be able to kind of hear a sound. But then I will screw on our Chladni plate. To perform the Chladni plate experiment, uh, what I'm going to do is sprinkle some science sand onto the plate, also known as some blue sand. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to slowly turn the volume up until the sand starts moving. And then as I change the frequency, when I get to one of the, the magic numbers that interacts with the resonant properties of this particular plate, you'll notice the sand will start moving into patterns. So here we go. Thank you.